Karen. <laughs> Hi. I'm just taking five minutes in, in like a really busy life. Well, anyway, I'm having five. Um, it's just that time of day when you sometimes just want to sit down and, and browse through a few magazines or something, look at the paper, have a drink. And um, that's what I'm doing. I've been looking through the stuff that the club sent me uh, recently. Well, sent all of us, I guess. I've got my, um, my maps, my handbook, been browsing through thinking where we might go um, on our first trip. <laughs> Can't wait for that. And obviously the club magazine. But I also found, I, it's just out of newspaper I think, but I found a recipe um, for some really simple biscuits, cookies they call them here. And uh, obviously, I, I, as you probably know by now, but I, I was on the Great British Bake Off a couple of years ago. And but baking for that has to be quite a complex arrangement, you know. Of course, Paul Hollywood wants showstoppers, doesn't he? Um, but they do have a biscuit week. And uh, yeah, I did okay in biscuit week. Anyway, this one, it only has three ingredients, which is pretty, pretty good, really, because it means that especially if, if you're um, away from home in, in your caravan or your motel. Um, these can be put together and baked. If it's a rainy day, which it is today, in fact, um, and the children can do these dead easy. Um, and it's peanut butter. Peanut butter is the main, main thing. So it's a peanut butter cookie. So you need for this... Um, 240 grams of crunchy peanut butter, which um, took the whole tub, the whole tub, like that. Um, but obviously it's very good for you, isn't it, peanuts? And less so the sugar. So the second ingredient is 100 grams of, of caster sugar and one egg. And basically, you beat them all together, make little, little uh, rounds of them and bake them for 10 minutes in a hot oven at 200 degrees or 180 fan but hot in your, in your caravan or your motel so anyway i've made some i made some earlier and that's what i've been having i'm going to quite fat i'm really easy i'm so easy i'm going to do it sat down Got my peanut butter. It's fairly, it's fairly soft. And you pop the sugar in there. And um, just blend it together. Um, I suppose if you've got an electric mixer, this will be a thing of seconds to make. But like today, it's just, it's just one of those days that doing something like this slowly sat at the kitchen table um is quite appealing really so that's it give that a, a squidge and then i don't need to put, i keep putting my glasses on um and the beaten egg so one egg indeterminate size i'm not putting all of it in because obviously if it's a big big egg it might make it a little bit too wet, the mixture. And then just mix that through. I've got some flour on. In fact, I think it's corn flour. It's whatever I'd handy. I've got that ready to form, form the balls. Um, so that's the egg in. I thought it might be a little, it might have been a really big egg. <laughs> but anyway, that's the mixture there and i've got a baking sheet flat sheets are always better than anything with a lip to get the heat and a bit of grease proof on it and um, you make them about the size of can i say a small golf ball <laughs> a bit maybe a walnut maybe a walnut 
size and pop it onto there and just continue going um, until you get right to the end. It says it makes 25. I didn't get 25 out of mine. But maybe I'm too generous with my portion control. It's always been, <laughs> been my problem. Um, so a bit of flower, flowery fingers. And basically you continue doing that until you've used all the mixture up. I'm just going to just wipe your fingers clean. And you mark them with your fork and press them down a little bit. So the heat of the oven will make them spread a little bit. But in actual fact, you just pop the fork on them to flatten them into shape. Like that. You see. And 10 minutes later, you'll have... Did you hear it? That's what Paul Hollywood always looks for in a biscuit. But of course, some biscuits are meant to be chewy, aren't they? But this one's actually really, really lovely and crisp. Right. With a copper. And um, a mm, bit of energy. So there we are. Three ingredient biscuit. Easy to make at home. In your caravan or in your motel. Try it and see. Thanks very much. Bye for now.